Hi, my name is Jane. I'm from Geek My Games, and today I want to talk to you about a game called Shogunut by Adrian Azell, published by Dreadful Games. I found this little game at Origins 2018 and decided to do an interview on how to play with one of the guys at the booth, and I kind of fell in love with it. So, without further ado, this is how you play Shogunut. Hello, I'm Tristan Batchelor, and today I'll be explaining Shogunate to you, a new game that came out recently. It's a social deduction game, a lot like Resistance or Coup, if you've played it before. The goal of the game is to get 12 honor on two leaders that you have been randomly dealt that you keep secret from everyone else. You want to get 12 between, say, Tiger or Wolf in any way possible. Then you just stop the game and say, I've won. You achieve this goal by moving your leaders with your cards in your deck up to certain honor points. From first position to last position, correlating with the board. The Hotomoto is a very important uh, aspect of the game. It switches after the end of every round. You do not play cards when you are the Hotomoto. Instead, you decide the order in which cards would be played. As such, if they played these three cards, I would say I wanted Path of the Arrow to go first. They would choose to move Crane Leader and then look at someone else's loyalty card. That's just one of the ways that you can impact the board in the game. And the Hanamoto chooses the timing in which that happens. The... This is how a normal round might look. Everyone would play a card face down. They would want... I would choose Honorable Company to go first, maybe. And they would move a leader down based on that uh, towards, and their goal might be to get Viper Leader here, to the third space. I would choose the next honorable company after that was discarded, and they would move them this way. Each, uh, two of each leader in the deck. So it is possible for you and someone else to share a leader, or you to have the same leader. If you have two of the same leader, you will gain double the honor for them. So you can win the game by having just six honor on one card. Okay. At the end of a round, you would give honor out to the ones correlated on the board, and then the Hatamoto would control the Shinobi. The Shinobi, in this case, either moves up or down one. He has to move. I would move him up, and the Shinobi, whether he is moved or not, on the position he is, always removes one honor. Then, the Hatamoto would change to the next player, and you would flip the card. This changes how the shinobi works each turn, and it also changes the objective each turn. And those are the basics of how to play Shogunate. So, Shogunate. Check out this game on your own. Let me know how you like it. Put it in the comments below. And until next time, don't just love your games, geek your games.